With harvest season in full swing, this is something you're likely to come across if you travel county roads. Yeah, it's annoying, but what can you do? We don't want to be on the road any more than they want us on the road. In order to get from field to field, farmers have to drive their equipment on the roads. If you get behind a combine or tractor, the best thing you can do is give them space and be aware of what's going on. The main thing is just the oncoming traffic and people that are trying to get around you as fast as they can. They just need to be just a little more patient with us. If you can't see the mirrors of, a, of, a, of the combine, then I can't see you. If you're right behind me, uh, I I'll, I'll, might see a shadow, but uh, it's, it's a little hard to uh, know, that, know if you're there. So uh, that's why I would ask you to, to stand back just a little bit. Another tip, if you're coming towards a farmer, don't just stop. If needed, it's easier for them to stop for you. And both farmers and drivers agree that it's better to get where you're going a few minutes later than risk an accident. Slow down and be respectful of them. I mean, they have it's their job and they didn't do their job. We wouldn't get the things that we needed. It's probably always better to be safe, especially when you know, no, you don't know what's coming, people turning off from the oncoming lane. You know, we have the, the, this, this big equipment. If, if uh, we tangle with a car, the equipment's going to win. In Morton, I'm Catherine Telez.